She did everything with a purpose and everybody knew her. Everybody loved her. Her laugh would literally just, you could hear it from everywhere. She was always there, always there to help you, hold your hand, guide you. She was a really good person. You never saw her without a smile on her face. And she was always there to help kids, inspire kids. And that kids knew that they could count on her no matter what. It just came to her naturally. When I first saw Ashley, she was so much fun, outgoing. She always would hug me every time, always had a smile on her face. The kids just drew to her because she was just so enjoyable to be around. She loved being with those kids and helping them share in their accomplishments. She taught me so much, inspired me to do so many different things. She was a very inspiring person. Yeah. She's, someone, she's someone that I aspire to be. She was yeah. someone you could go to when you were having trouble with anything. And she would anything. always, she would understand yeah. no matter what. She just made you feel comfortable, like loved. She always wanted to be your friend. No matter who you were. Yeah. All of those Axel kids that are here and even kids that are older and younger, I mean, she was just there to help and teach them because that's just who she was. I think that it's most important to have teachers like that because some of your teachers nowadays don't really have a connection with you and definitely had that family relationship connection with Ashley. She wasn't just a teacher. She was a teacher and a friend and a cheerleader all rolled into one. And that's what kids appreciate, having somebody that they know is invested in them as a person, not just a name on the roll sheet. She definitely left a mark on everybody she spoke to. Everybody remembers Ashley Roddy. Like she couldn't blend in if she tried. That was, she was just out there. This photo has actually been made into a t-shirt. This one we love. She grabbed this trophy. It's not even her trophy, but she was just as excited for the young lady that won the trophy even, as if it was her own accomplishment. But it was the animal that she sold and she was so proud of it. And so they've got this picture on the front of the shirt and on the back of the shirt it has hold that head up, you know, just because that's what she that's told our me. Motto. That's that's the kid's motto. The picture of her holding a trophy and I won that trophy last year and she was there for me with that. That was her heifer that I won that trophy with and I have never heard her scream so loud until I won that trophy. <laughs> Everybody who knew her knew she was loud. <laughs> but like, when I mean loud, I mean like live your life in a way that's loud. So in your movements and what you do with your life, um, just do it with pride and have fun. Love what you do. And her laugh, when when <laughs> the girl won that trophy, you could hear her all over the, the show ring in Houston that, that uh, she was yelling and she just, she loved it. She loves sharing in other people's accomplishments as well. You look in all these pictures, she always had that smile on her face and that's what everybody remembers about her. You don't ever realize how many people you affect until, until later and I think that was a big deal. We had no idea how many people she inspired or whatever you want to call it, but just to know that in her short 27 years, she touched a lots of lots of people all over the state of Texas. And as a parent, that makes us feel wonderful. I feel like that we'll continue to talk about her for generations. That's comforting to me. She, she left an impact and, and it'll be here for a long time.